Hello lovelies! If you are looking to step up your side dish game this fall, then have I got the recipe for you. It's these incredible garlic butter potatoes and they are seriously a flavor bomb of goodness. These potatoes are life altering. They are so good, so crispy, so loaded with flavor and honestly worth every bit of effort. Now, one of the secrets to making these potatoes incredible is actually parboiling them, which is just gonna help them get a little bit tender. It's also gonna help some of the starch come to the surface, which is how we're going to get them ultra, ultra crispy. Now, for this recipe, I'm using about three pounds of baby red potatoes that I've just cut in half. You could use pretty much any kind of potatoes you want, and you can leave the skins on, which is so convenient and I'm gonna let those cook for between five and seven minutes. We just wanna help get the cooking process started so that they don't have to spend as much time in the oven. Now, while my potatoes are boiling away, I'm gonna be mixing up a whole lot of deliciousness to bake them with. So in a bowl, I'm going to be combining some freshly grated Parmesan cheese. Now, in a recipe like this, I always recommend freshly grated Parmesan cheese because I find the flavor makes a huge difference. I also have some olive oil here. I've got some garlic, and when I say some, I mean quite a lot of garlic. This is about four cloves, and I've really finely minced it because you don't want big chunks of garlic. You want it to be well distributed. And then finally, I'm also going to add some Italian seasoning to this, and then I'm just gonna mix that all together until it's well combined. I mean, I actually don't think it's possible for these to be bad. Okay, so my potatoes are par-cooked. I'm gonna get them into a bowl. They're still nice and hot, they're a little bit soft, and I just am gonna go ahead and add this incredible parm garlic mixture all over the top. You wouldn't know it at this point, but this mixture is going to create an incredible, crispy, flavorful coating for these potatoes that is going to make them some of the best that you've ever had. Now, I wanna make sure that these are really evenly coated so they're well tossed in all that goodness. And I also, at this point, wanna make sure that I'm salting these liberally and adding some pepper as well. I like salting these once before I cook them and once after, so you get a really nice seasoning happening. Oh my gosh, you can smell the heavenliness already. Yes, heavenliness is a thing, okay? Because I made it a thing, it's a thing. Now at this point, I'm ready to transfer my potatoes to my baking sheet. It's important, of course, that your baking sheet be well greased because you don't want these sticking, right? Now if you find them too hot to handle, it's fine, just use some tongs instead. I'm going to arrange them cut side down on my baking sheet. By arranging them cut side down, we're gonna ensure that that cut side ends up with the most crispy golden texture imaginable. And trust me, that is a good thing because that's how the best flavor develops. All right, my potatoes are arranged on my baking sheet, which means it's time to get these beauties into the oven at 400 degrees Fahrenheit for about 25 to 30 minutes. After 15 minutes, I'm gonna give them a flip and let them continue cooking until they are beautiful and golden and ready to be devoured. Okay, so we have reached the promised land and let me tell you guys, it is delicious. There is so much goodness happening here. Everything is so crispy and yummy. I'm just gonna transfer these to a bowl and then we're going to finish these off with a final step that is going to blow your mind, I promise. So this is gonna sound a little rich and decadent, but honestly guys, trust me on this, it is totally worth doing. I'm going to add a big drizzle of melted butter onto these potatoes and also toss them with a little bit of freshly chopped parsley. And honestly, the combination of that butter, that garlic, that Parmesan, and that parsley is enough to blow your taste buds away. This is one recipe you've gotta give a try for yourselves. These potatoes are super crisp, super tender, so flavorful, and absolutely delicious. I hope you guys love this yumminess as much as I do and that you will give it a try for yourselves. If you do, be sure to tweet me, Instagram me, or Facebook me a photo because you know how much I love seeing your kitchen creations. Remember, this recipe, like all of my recipes, is featured on my website, thedomesticgeek.com. You can find it there or linked in the description box below. And finally, if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe because there is lots more deliciousness where this came from.